Good morning. It is Jane with Scraptastic Yarns. Are you ready for some shout outs today? Yeah, I got my hair cut. Long time coming. It's been driving me nuts, but you know, things were a little busy, but I decided time for it to go. It's driving me nuts. So, if you see the horns start cropping up, just know it's a normal part of my life. So, welcome to all of you who have stuck with me so far, and welcome to anyone who has newly found me. I appreciate you coming by, stopping to see me. Today is one of those days where I feature some new channels that I have found, and I think you might enjoy some of these. So here we go. First, there is Adventures with Mama. This is Tina. Now, Tina's channel is a little bit different. I do see some yarny stuff on there, but I think she tends to try to live off the grid. So there's a little bit of living off the grid, planting, gardening, those kind of things. So check Tina out. Then there is Sunflowers Creative Showcase and Crochet. This is Ashley. She does crafts, all kinds of crafts, and, of course, crochet. You know, I just noticed you guys are kind of crooked. Maybe I need to hold myself a little this way. We'll just all deal with it, right? Then there is Anna's Got a Crochet. I think you'll really like hers. This next lady is Barbara. And I'm really enjoying her videos. This is Visit Mima. Now, she does crochet. She is an, a little older than some of us. But I am enjoying her chit-chats and her coffee. And she does a little period where she reads the viewers' comments. So I'm enjoying her channel. And she always has a very positive, uplifting message that she ends with. So, once again, check her out. Then there is Hooks to Hooks. And this is a young lady that has tutorials. Now, she hasn't done any videos lately, and I hope she comes back to doing that. And you know, in the past, I showed you the little baseball caps that we make for the hospital, the local hospital for the nursery during Little League season because Williamsport is right smack dab, the home center where all the Little League World Series are played. So we do that every August for that in celebration of that. She has an adorable blanket that is a baseball baby blanket. So, I'm planning on throwing in a blanket with that to go for one of the lucky babies. Then there is Priya's Creative Hut. She has a lot of creative ideas, along with crochet as well. Um, and I think it's spelled, I think it's Priya. It may be Pira, but I'm not positive, so check her out. This next lady comes from South Africa and that is made by Jaylene. She does crochet and knit, has a beautiful channel, shows off some beautiful items, so check out Jaylene. Then there is Emmy Crochet. Emmy, um, I believe a lot of hers are just little snippets, but I think you might enjoy seeing those little pieces of shorts that she's doing and maybe she'll add a little longer video. And then there is No Place Like Home. This is Mary. Um, I think you'll enjoy her channel as well. The next one is a knit designer. And this is Margaret with Whimsy North Knit. She just recently started a channel. And um, I'm hoping that you'll really enjoy um, watching her videos. And then, of course, there is Connie's Crafty Corner. And Connie does knit and crochet as well. So, there you have it. There's a few good new channels to check out. See if you like them. And I had somebody ask me one time, Jane, 
Why do you shout out new channels? Wouldn't you want to just build up your own and not worry about other people? Yeah, no, not really. <laughs> um, you know, you never know. There may be someone that you really prefer to watch over me, over somebody else. But I hope that because of all the shout outs, that even if you don't watch my regular podcast, that you'll come back for the shout outs so that you can get a few other channels that you may resonate and may really like. So that is my whole thing. I think we should support one another. And this is my way of supporting other channels. New, large, those of us that have been around forever. So, uh, yeah, that is just one way that I choose to do that. And I will continue as long as I can find channels. And I'm sure there will be new channels here and there coming up. There always are. You never know. I might throw in some of my favorite uh, you know, not crochet, knit related at all. Um, I do have a couple of Guilty Pleasure channels that I watch. Alright, I'm going to share one of those. And it is Mommy of Two Dumpster Diver. Now, I love this gal's channel. She does dumpster diving. Um, and she is in the Pittsburgh area. And I'm sorry. I just love Shannon. There is one thing that she has done with this. Most everything that she collects is given away to those in need. And it's just amazing the things that she finds that people throw in the dumpsters. Businesses that's like, what? You know, they could be donating those to charity instead of having people who feel the need to dumpster dive pull those out but I'm glad for those channels that do dumpster dive and yeah I do have a couple of them that I watch because I find it fascinating the things that they find all right that's it for today and uh, let's see as you know there is something always to be found out in your surroundings enjoy the beauty the glory and remember, there was a creator that created all of this for us to enjoy. And be kind to one another. See you guys soon. Bye.